Hey guys, Nick and Viv here. Welcome to Clifton Hill, Niagara Falls, Ontario. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take you a walk up one side and down the other and sort of show you what's going on here on a Saturday in November uh, 2021. Uh, we'll, we'll try and explain to you some of the stuff that's around here and hope and hopefully it doesn't get uh, too uh, loud and uh, noisy here. We've got a hotel, the Sheridan, just above. Sheridan above this Starbucks here is ice cream. This is actually a, a souvenir shop. Uh, prices are okay. Uh, you 50% go, off. You can find some deals. Well, it's 50% off. They're already skyrocketed prices. <laughs> so we've got some ice cream shops here on the side. Games, rides, and fun. Uh, this is one of those places where you can buy uh, one card that takes you to a bunch of different attractions including the Extreme Movie Ride 4D uh, which is right here and I think uh, they got some stuff going on here with uh, I don't know bees and some dinosaurs and stuff like that. We have a Rainforest Cafe, <laughs> the wild place to shop and eat. Oh, Rainforest Cafe right beside the Niagara Brew Brewing Company. Very cool here. Distillery and barbecue. Not bad, never eaten there, but it's been here for a while, so it's gotta be pretty good. The famous Ruby Tuesday. This Ruby Tuesdays has been here for quite a number of years. Ruby Tuesdays from uh, back in the 80s. Wasn't there a club up here at one point? That's correct. Yeah, I can't remember the name of it, but uh, I believe back when I was in high school. No, the, was the club called Ruby Tuesdays? Oh, well, there you go. I learned something new every day. And then we have our Movie Land Wax Museum of the Stars. We're gonna do that on the on the way back. So let's go to the Fun House here. Wow, that's a long lineup. Travel Lodge. Um, you know what, even though it's like a motel, um, they're actually not bad here on, uh, on Clifton Hill. They're clean and they're, the prices are not bad. Uh, you got a playland for the kids and one of the many, many haunted houses here on uh, Clifton Hill. They do a really good job of these places. Well, next on the list, we got the big top, Maze Fun. Tons of stuff going on here. Hope you guys, uh, you know what, I don't see any prices anywhere, but I think this is all included in that uh, buy one card. And for it's, a, it's a fun pass. It's a fun pass, wonderful. And it includes about five, six attractions. Um, which are uh, pretty amazing. We've done that before. And then obviously another gift shop, gigs and giggles, and I think uh, t-shirts and souvenirs. Uh, well, truly Canadian, you got the Blue Moose Trading Company. Again, another souvenir shop. And uh, a fantastic photo op here beside the Blue Moose. And the Harley Davidson shop with a pizza pizza upstairs as well. Uh, next here we got the Thrift Lodge. I've never actually stayed here, Viv, have you ever? No, I have not. No, okay, well. I don't want to comment on that one too much. I don't know anything about it. <laughs> family restaurant? Which is called the family restaurant. <laughs> Let's uh, see what they have on the menu here. Well, there you go. There you go. One pancake, one egg, one sausage, one bacon, and some whole fries for only $12.49 Canadian. Uh, we invite you to visit our patio at Ruby Tuesdays. Well, that's interesting. Well, right now they are currently closed, 
due to the pandemic, of course, which has caused a lot of these restaurants to shut down as they were not able to uphold. Um, but there's still great support in the community and outside of. Uh, so we're one of them being here. And what are we going to check out next? Uh, here we go. We're going to the fun zone. Uh, mirror maze, laser tag, and laser maze. Oh, oh, but one of our favorites. Absolutely one of our wonderful favorites. I love these things. You get a little cup of ice cream and a, a semi-circular churro. Warm, beautiful, and they, they, they can fill it with chocolate or caramel or, or any of those fun things. You have your Benihana Japanese Steakhouse. There's a Benihana's here? Wow. There's a Benihana's here, and people. And then your Applebee's and IHOP. Back so, to back. Well, isn't that wonderful? And one of the staples down here on uh, Clifton Hill, the famous Burger King with the Frankenstein. Frankenstein. Eating a Whopper. So just uh, show you down the street here, one of the little side streets here. There's another mirror maze. Apparently, uh, People love mirror mazes here. Down here, we have uh, the Fusion Wraps and uh, the Upside Down House, the Halal Sandwich Place in the corner. Okay. As Viv was saying there, you might not have heard. It's a Papa John's, there's a Fusion Wrap Place. Uh, as a Wonder Mart. Uh, I think that's a Cha Time? Cha? Cha Time? You thinking that's uh, tea? Perhaps. Perhaps. Wonderful. Check out this, guys. Animatronics. Very, very cool. Okay. Okay, so we're almost at the top of Clifton Hill here, um, but uh, no Canadian uh, getaway for a weekend wouldn't be better than better the beaver, than tails. beaver tails. These are great. As you can see, everybody's waiting in line for them. And then the Frankenstein house. Another haunted house. These are all great. Any one of these things that you go to here is fantastic. Okay, well, what we'll do here is we'll just take a little pan shot uh, across the street here and show you what they got. Uh, they got some burger places, Indian cuisine, a burger factory, uh, cannabis shop, Starbucks, currency exchange. Um, oh, and all kinds of fantastic restaurants. Tons of restaurants, tons of restaurants. We've actually eaten at that uh, Montana's there on the patio right on the, the street there. In, it was really good. Yeah, that uh, Italian restaurant, the pizzeria. Is oh, very yeah. well known. And here we go. So, let's go down the other side of uh, Clifton Hill now. We want to go around. No, we're gonna go down here. Okay. Kelsey's uh, Pub Grub and uh, burgers and sandwiches and stuff like that. Um, actually, it's really good, actually. Look, honey, there's King Kong. King Kong? He's, he's on a house or some building. What is he holding? The top of some building I th that it, he's it, torn down. Oh, wow, look at that. Ripley's Believe It or Not. So this is the famous Ripley's Believe It or Not. Uh, it's got tons of great stuff in here. Uh, I've been through here many, many times. Let's see if we can... Film here a little bit. I know you. Okay, guys. Uh, next on our list here. Oh, what? Well, you know what? 
Should we go down and show everybody that? Yeah, but we're going down this okay, direction well, and then going in. We'll go this way. So we, next we got Wizards Golf. Uh, another fun attraction here in Niagara Falls. Apparently mini golf and uh, mazes and haunted houses are the way to go here. Canada Trading Company. This is another souvenir shop. Uh, you can get some mugs and coats and uh, not coats. Sorry, uh, sweaters and hats and toques and uh, stuff for the kids. Truly Canadian stuff. And speaking of truly Canadian, um, how about a Tim Hortons? Good old Timmy. You know what? I got to tell you, I, I don't like sweet drinks, but their hot chocolate is amazing. Okay, so back uh, behind this Tim Hortons here, uh, let me let me walk around here. This is this is a, a newer part, I guess, but it's been here for a while. This we've actually done this, and it's it's amazing. It's actually really really good. Um, and then. On the side of it there, you got the Dinosaur Adventure Golf. Which was so much fun. That takes you a good hour or so. And if you take the time and enjoy it, be in the moment. I do believe there's two separate courses there. So uh, like an easy one and like a, a advanced. And uh, both of them were amazing. A uh, lot, a lot of fun to do, to do that mini golf. Um, let me see here. On this okay, the so there yeah, there's a zombie attack down there, but what I'm going to show here is the go karts. It's a multi level go kart track. Uh, a ton of fun. You know, that was a great, great thing to do. There's the zombie attack 4D theater that's back there that you actually they actually give you like laser guns and you shoot at the screen. Uh, <laughs> a lot of fun doing that too. We do. And just to inform everybody, um, coming to these attractions, wherever they may be located in uh, Niagara, there is ample parking. However, it will cost you a little bit, uh, but it's generally for an all day. Now, just as we were talking about those passes before, um, you can get a pass here. Let me see if I can zoom in on that. Sunday pass includes six attractions. Um, I can't remember how much the pass cost though. As far as I can remember, the pass was only about 30 bucks. That's what Viv is going to ask. Even better. He's a little busy right now. Ah. I think it's around the $30 range. I'm pretty sure that is. I'll show you guys while she's finding that out. I'm going to show you the sky wheel here. This is, it's really cool. Wow. And then uh, on the side here, you do have a, a bowling alley. Uh, last time we were here, this bowling alley was actually closed uh, due to COVID. Uh, but it looks like they're up and running now. There's a little bit of an arcade inside there. Uh, I guess it's uh, you can win tickets and get prizes and stuff like that. I'm just gonna walk a little bit here and hopefully Viv catches up to us. Okay. Okay, guys. Viv, Viv just got back and uh, she just found out. Uh, and I'm glad she asked. Those passes for the six uh, different things are not even being sold right now because not all of those attractions are open. So um, I guess you'd have to pay for each uh, individual uh, each individual attraction by itself. Sorry guys, the, the music's a little bit loud right now. Um, we'll try and get back past this as quickly as possible. And we'll continue down Clifton Hill. So. Boston Pizza here. Let me get you a shot of this thing from this side. 
Amazing. At night, this thing glows. It's amazing. Wonderful. And they do have the sky will open until midnight. Oh. So keep that in mind. Beautiful. Oh, okay. Beautiful. It's a wide enough shot here. I'll show you a little bit more of what's going on. Uh, Dippin' Dots. Uh, that, that's the little ice cream that's... Uh, it's actually, uh, what is it, freeze-dried? I, I don't know what they do. They, they flash freeze it. Kind of looks like that. Kind of really cool. These are the flavors. Oh, and uh, there are some prices for you. Sorry, guys, we haven't been showing you all the prices. But let's see what we got here. We're going to get past this lineup over here. Sorry, just passing through. Okay, got some hot dogs. Oh, the Fudge Factory. Uh, oh, that's a famous one. We stop in here almost God, all the time. The let's let's see if we can quickly jump in, even though I'm not wearing my mask. Let's see here. Uh, let's just do one of these. Let's just do one of those. Okay. Uh, Okay. What do we got next here? Oh, it smells so good. Okay, my battery is going low. Okay, we got Ghost Blaster, the great Canadian Midway, uh, a bunch of like uh, arcade games, and uh, do you win uh, prizes? And t just like this, you brought you in tickets and prizes and stuff like that. I'm not coming in. <laughs> Just want to show everybody. There you go, guys. And we continue on. And then we got Wendy's. Now, I will say, this Wendy's is really good because if you're looking for a bathroom, their bathrooms are very, very clean. And I don't think they stop you either. They, they let you go in anytime anyways. Uh, next is... Uh, That's not Michael Keaton. Is it? <laughs> no. Who is it? Oh, that's um. Joaquin Phoenix? No. Or no. Who is that no, guy? No, no, the one that passed away. Uh, I his name. <laughs> okay, we're gonna cut out this part. Okay, one <laughs> second. One second. Hey, look, it's Movie Land. Uh, oh, that's from Batman. Wow, that's really well done. Very, very realistic. These are great. Uh, they always do a good job in these places. It was fun. Uh, section that'll uh, flip you out a little. Now an adult here is $11.99 and a child is $6.99. And uh, oh wow, they got all the cinema monsters like Elvira, Mistress of the Dark, Freddy Krueger, and my favorite Frankenstein being showcased inside Movie Land. They've just removed that display. Okay. Bone Blaster Shooting Gallery. I guess you put your uh, your dollar in there and you get to shoot some stuff. That's pretty cool. Another ice cream shop is closed here. And guys, it looks like we have reached the end of Clifton Hill. So let me just flip this camera over here, which I can't for some reason. Okay. Well, That's okay. Well, guys, again, we want to thank you all for watching. Um, please like, share, and subscribe. We really appreciate it. It will help our channel grow. Uh, we will try and put out more videos uh, all around uh, from Las Vegas. Hopefully, you know, some here from Niagara Falls. Uh, maybe a, Toronto. We'll be doing a lot in Toronto as well uh, from uh, where we're from. We're going to be going to uh, probably... Oh, there's, there's a lot of trips planned for this year. So uh, please subscribe and uh, we'll see you on the next one. Ciao.